Mbappe will be detained for four days in the 1.3 billion shillings land fraud case. This is after court pushed the ruling on his bond application to Monday next week. As Martin Masharia now reports, Chilogoi has previously failed to own a court summons and despite four previous warrants of arrest being issued against him. Former Provincial Commissioner Davis Chilugui will spend four days in remand as he awaits a court ruling on whether he will be granted a bail or not. Chilugui presented himself in court and denied six criminal charges leveled against him. In the first count, he is accused of defrauding businesswoman Ashok Rupshi Shah and Itakian Kumar Raja of a parcel of land measuring 7.3 hectares located on Lower Kabete Road valued at 1.3 billion Kenya shillings. Count number one. The judge is conspiracy to default on Constitution 17, the penal code. Davis, Madam Chalogu, true or not true? Not true. Chalogui also faces charges of forgery and uttering forged documents. The prosecution alleges that he forged a letter of allotment dated January 31st, 1995, and a certificate of title. Through his lawyer, Chalogui requested that the court to grant him bail, assuring that he would comply with the court directives and attend all court proceedings. Grant lenient <coughs> bond terms to the accused person. We are afraid to pass on a bond because they are senior citizen and have uh, rendered services to this country. However, the prosecution objected to his release on bail, suggesting that if bail was granted, strict bond terms without the option of cash bail should be imposed and Chilugui should be directed to deposit his passports. The lawyer presenting the victims opposed Chilugui's bail application, stating that the PC had been infringing on the rights of the victims and asked the court not to grant him bail. Your Honor, should this honorable court be inclined to grant uh, bail or bond, we pray that this honorable court only grants strict bond terms without the option of cash bill and we also pray that the accused person deposits his passport with court. Trial Magistrate Dolphin Alego indicated that she will deliver a ruling on Monday in next week. But I will definitely give a ruling on the 25th of March about the bond and bail. Martin Masharia, Look Up TV. The Salaries and Remuneration Commission Chairperson